bitch to the ceiling. Nigga, I'm killing your villain. Oh, stay chilling. Bitch, boy, you was not safe. Now do what I want. Give a fuck how you feel. Alright, yo, we back with another video. You feel me? Big Weezy in the cut, yo. Weezy out of here. I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna lie. Y'all can see the title of this video. It's pretty simple. I just wanna let y'all know from the jump. PSA, I am not from Philly, okay? These are words that I've just been hearing around the school that I go to, because the school I go to is outside of Philly type shit. So if I if I mess up, y'all gotta understand. You know what I'm saying? Drop a like on that, John. And let's get into a straight business word. First word? The first word, bro. The first word is sliz. S-L-I-Z-Z. -Z. If somebody call you sliz, that mean you grimy. That mean, you, if somebody say you sliz, you 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 being weird. Tight shit, you being weird, first of all. If you if somebody call you sliz or you doing some grimy shit, you, you backdooring niggas, you, you, you being weird, bro. So that's the best way I could put it for y'all. If y'all can, if y'all can explain these better, bro, y'all can hop in the comments and have a Field day with it. Have a field day. Second word. Basic word is John. This word has expanded outside of Philly for show. Sure. I've been saying this probably since I was a jit. But John can literally mean anything. John could be a girl. John could be food. John could be, I'm going to get this John. It could be literally be anything. John is literally anything. So don't even, don't even trip about that. Word. Next word. Thorough. I'm not gonna lie, I first heard this word two years ago before I even came here. And I was talking to this one this one girl and she said, Oh, you thorough. And I said, What does that even mean? What do you mean thorough? Thorough mean like you you solid, like like you 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 thorough, like you a great guy type shit. I appreciate you, you thorough. You do if you do somebody a favor, you're thorough. You know what I'm saying? If you if you doing something you're doing something right. That's being good, I guess. So we're thorough. If you thorough, that means you're doing the right thing. Tight shit. Or you, you looking out. It's good looking. Good looking. Tight shit. Next word. If you've been feeling it, you don't know this. I don't know. It's your mean. Your mean just mean like you, you feel me? Like you understand? Tight shit. Like you mean. It's just, it's weird. It's weird. I ain't gonna lie. Anyways. You mean just mean like you feel me? Like you understand? Tight shit. So we're next word. Keep it a bean. Keep it a bean. I have not. I start, I say this a lot now. I was not saying that before, before I even came here. I didn't know what that meant. Keep it a bean means be honest. You know what I'm saying? Keep it a hundred. Keep it a stack. You know that. Keep it a stack. Keep it a hundred. Keep it a bean. Or that's big, basic, self-explanatory. Joe. Joe? <laughs> Joe's a funny one. If somebody call you Joe, that means you you social, bro. You you social. You talk a lot. Tight shit. You Joe. You talk to everybody. You know everybody. You Joe. Tight shit. Because everybody know a Joe. Joe is a basic name, so I think... People in Philly just, you know, took that word and said, oh, they're going to use it and call somebody that when, you know, you talking to everybody and you know everybody, you Joe, if you know everybody type shit, you social type shit. So, um, chop. I did not know what chop meant, bro. Somebody said, I'm going to chop to me one time and I said, what's chop? I'm standing there looking dumb. But chop means, chop is the children's hospital of Philadelphia. And that's just the abbreviation of the words. It's just chop. I don't know why. Everybody call it chop. It's known as chop in Philly. So, word. If you hear chop, that's probably what that means. Um. Oh. Dicked. Okay. Okay. This one. This one makes me upset, bro. Because I just. I don't know. This one makes me upset. Dicked. If somebody said, oh, you just got dicked or a dick theme or a dick thumb type shit, that means you just got like, like, you just got done slime type shit. Like, oh, if I, instead of they saying, I just beat you in Madden, I dicked you the other day, I dicked you in Madden. Feel me? You, you got dicked. I don't know who came up with this, but whoever came up with this, bro, I don't know. You got, you got some explaining to do, bro, because first of all, it is hella AO. Hella ayo, I hate saying this, but it's so common now. Everybody say it. So if you got dicked, it means you lost or you got fried. Like you just you got you you got cooked. You got cooked basically. Now, dickhead is another word. I don't know why. Was I don't know what's up with Philly and dick, but dickhead. If somebody call you a dickhead, they'd be like, oh dickhead. 
feeling niggas love saying that stupid ass shit. They use the word dickhead a lot. And dickhead, you know, a dickhead is self-explanatory. But they use it in a joking manner more than a serious manner. If somebody call you a dickhead, they, there's like, they like 75% joking type shit. Because it's not, they're not being serious. They call you a dickhead just like, they poking fun type shit. That's how the feeling needs to be poking fun. So, if niggas call you a dickhead, they playing, bro. They just playing. Don't, don't take it to heart if you're not for Philly. Uh, young bull, young bull, basic. It's pretty uh self-explanatory. Young bull just mean like you you a young bull. I guess it's it's kind of like basic. Bull is just a person. So a bull is a bull could be anyone. It's usually a guy when you say bull type shit. So young bull just mean like oh you you a young bull you a jit type shit. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with being a young bull. Nothing wrong with that. Um bull you know I just said that just like being a guy. Yo 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 yo. One I almost forgot. One I almost forgot is the bid. The bid. If somebody say you the bid. They joking, or you a joke? They saying like you a jokester, or like a bid. I don't know. Bid is a funny one, and if anyone can explain this better, go ahead. Cause I know I'm gonna have a tough time right now. But if somebody say you the bid, they basically just saying like, oh, you the bid. Like you play too much. You joke a lot, or like type shit, or you know you never really like serious type shit. So if somebody say you the bid, like oh you, you like I don't know how to explain. You just you play too much. You play too much. I guess you say. If somebody call you the bid, so word and yeah, so bro, if I forgot any bro, keep it a bean. Let me know in the comments. That's all I could think of the top of my head. I had a list, but you know I record my phone, so I can't really. You know what I'm saying? You mean? <laughs> you mean? They're gonna get me. That's a Philly slang that y'all should know though. If y'all want a part two, let me know. And, yeah, we out of here. We out of here.